Uh, go ahead, sorry. Yeah. Is the White House concerned at all that the Fed is predicting that the unemployment rate is going to rise by the end of the year? So look, I'm gonna uh, I'm going to let the certainly the Fed uh, speak for for itself, um, uh, as they have. Uh, I'll say this: as their statement said today, the economic activity has continued to expand and at a solid pace, and the unemployment rate remains low. Uh, and as Chair Powell just said moments ago, the labor market is actually in sol solid condition. Uh, it is clear that our e economy remains strong. You know, as we're talking about foreign policy, we have the strongest economy, leading the strong strongest economy in the world. Uh, and unemployment is still low at 4.2 percent, with the lowest uh, average of unemployment of any administration in 50 years. 142,000 jobs created last month, nearly 16 million jobs created under the Biden-Harris administration. Wages are going faster uh, than than prices are, uh, and uh, than prices are. So I think these are important. Uh, data and points to, to, to also uh, lift up as well. Uh, but again, the Fed also spoke for themselves in, in, in speaking to the strength of the economy and the economic activity as well. I know you can't speak to politics, but t the Teamster today decided not to endorse any candidate in the election. Can you just speak to the administration's relationship with the Teamsters? Obviously, you guys have done a lot with them, <coughs> $36 billion in aid. Um, is the president surprised at all by that? So look, I, I'm not going to get into endorsements uh, from any organization, including today the Teamsters. Uh, that is certainly something that the campaign could speak to. Uh, as you know, this is a president and, and a vice president that has fought uh, hard for unions throughout their administration. Uh, this administration, in the past three and a half years, he has been called the most pro-union uh, president ever. Uh, the president finds is very proud uh, to to have that um, uh, to have that title, if you will, uh, and. Let's not forget, he's brought American manufacturing back home, uh, creating close to 800,000 manufacturing jobs, uh, and by creating the first Made in America office. And so these are things that he's incredibly proud of, uh, and uh, and he believes if you know, the, you know, the, the union labor built the middle class. You hear him say that all the time, uh, and so can't speak to any sort of endorsements. That's for the campaign to speak to directly. Uh, but this is a president who has uh, base, really has, has put, uh, when it comes to uh, union uh, and bringing, uh, bringing jobs back to, uh, back to America, he has put that front and center of his economy, basically economic policy. Okay.